Noonan Syndrome, Wikipedia article audio Noonan Syndrome is a relatively common autosomal dominant congenital disorder and is named after Jacqueline Noonan, a pediatric cardiologist. It is referred to as the male version of Turner's syndrome, however, the genetic causes of Noonan syndrome and Turner syndrome are distinct and both males and females are affected. The principal features include congenital heart defect, short stature, learning problems, pectus excavatum, impaired blood clotting, and a characteristic configuration of facial features including a webbed neck and a flat nose bridge. NS is a rosopathy, and is one of several disorders that are caused by a disruption of RASMAPK signaling pathway. Characteristics Organ system Anesthesia risk Heart Lungs Gastrointestinal system Genitourinary system Lymphatic system Developmental Recommendations Hematologic Musculoskeletal Neurological Physical appearance Stature Head Eyes Nose Ears and hearing Mouth and speech Limbs slash extremities Skin Causes Diagnosis Intrauterine ultrasound Prognosis It is believed that between approximately 1 in 1,000 and 1 in 2,500 children worldwide are born with NS. It is one of the most common genetic syndromes associated with congenital heart disease, similar in frequency to Down syndrome. However, the range and severity of features can vary greatly in patients with NS. Therefore, the syndrome is not always identified at an early age. History Up to 85% of people with NS have one of the following heart defects. Recurrence in siblings and apparent transmission from parent to child has long suggested a genetic defect with autosomal dominant inheritance and variable expression. Mutations in the RAS mitogen activated protein kinase signaling pathways are known to be responsible for 70% of NS cases. A person with NS has up to a 50% chance of transmitting it to their offspring. The fact that an affected parent is not always identified for children with NS suggests several possibilities. Heterozygous mutations in NRAS, HRAS, BRAF, SHOC2, MAP2K1, MAP2K2, and CBL have also been associated with a smaller percentage of NS and related phenotypes. A condition known as neurofibromatosis Noonan syndrome is associated with neurofibromin. NS can be confirmed genetically by the presence of any of the known mutations listed above. However, despite identification of 14 causative genes, the absence of a known mutation will not exclude the diagnosis, as there are more, as yet undiscovered genes that cause NS. Thus, the diagnosis of NS is still based on clinical features. In other words, it is made when a physician feels that a patient has enough of the features to warrant the label. The principal values of making a genetic diagnosis are that it guides additional medical and developmental evaluations, it excludes other possible explanations for the features, and it allows more accurate recurrence risk estimates. With more genotype-phenotype correlation studies being performed, a positive genetic diagnosis will help the clinician to be aware of possible anomalies specific to that certain gene mutation. 
For example, there is an increase in hypertrophic cardiomyopathy in patients with a mutation of CRAS and an increased risk of juvenile myelomonocytic leukemia for a mutation of PTPN11. In the future, studies may lead to a targeted management of NS symptoms that depends on what genetic mutation a patient has. Radiologic Diagnosis First trimester ultrasound of Noonan syndrome reveals nucleodema slash cystic hygroma almost same as seen in Turner syndrome. Follow-up scans may show clinical features that already described above. A study shows this disease is also associated with hepatosplenomegaly with renal anomalies including malrotation and solitary kidney. A rare incidence of chold ocal cyst is also reported as well. A 2007 study followed 112 individuals for a mean of 12 years. No patient died during follow-up, but several required medical interventions. The mean final heights were 167 and 153 cm for men and women, respectively which is approximately two standard deviations below normal. Jacqueline Noonan was practicing as a pediatric cardiologist at the University of Iowa when she noticed that children with a rare type of heart defect, valvular pulmonary stenosis, often had a characteristic physical appearance, with short stature, webbed neck, wide-spaced eyes, and low-set ears. Both boys and girls were affected. These characteristics were sometimes seen running in families but were not associated with gross chromosomal abnormalities. She studied 833 patients at the Congenital Heart Disease Clinic, looking for other congenital abnormalities, and in 1963 presented a paper, Associated non-cardiac malformations in children with congenital heart disease. This described nine children who in addition to congenital heart disease had characteristic facial features, chest deformities, and short stature. Dr. John Opitz, a former student of Dr. Noonan, first began to call the condition Noonan syndrome when he saw children who looked like those whom Dr. Noonan had described. Dr. Noonan produced a paper entitled Hypertelearism with Turner Phenotype in 1968, and in 1971 at the Symposium of Cardiovascular Defects, the name Noonan syndrome became officially recognized. Pulmonary valvular stenosis, septal defects, atrial or ventricular, hypertrophic cardiomyopathy.